Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Here we have given a plus b equal to 1, a square plus b square equal to. So find the value of a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11. So how can we solve this problem? Let's see. a to the power of a plus b equal to 1 we have given a plus b equal to 1 so this is given value so in this in this equation so we can take uh, a plus b whole square and one square so I'm applying squares on both sides. Now, so we know this formula a plus b whole square. So a square plus b square plus 2ab equals 1. Now, so a square plus b square value, we know this. We have given this value. So just substitute the value of a square plus b square in this equation so 2 plus 2 a b equal to 1 2 a b equal to so move this number to the right side 1 minus 2 2 a b equal so 1 minus 2 which is equal to minus 1 Now a b equal minus 1 divided by 2. So this is a a times b value. So let, let us consider this is equation 1. So now a plus b equal 1. So from this equation again we can take uh, this is a plus b cube plus 1 cube so a plus b cube so we know this formula so a cube plus b cube plus 3 a b times a plus b equal to 1 so a cube plus b cube so plus so we know this a plus b value so a plus b value is 1 so just substitute we know this a b value so a b value 3 a b value is minus 1 by 2 and a plus b value is 1 equal 1 a cube plus b cube so minus 3 minus 3 by 2 equal 1 a cube plus b cube equal so move this value to the right side so 1 plus 3 by 2 equal to 5 by 2 so a cube plus b cube equal 5 by 2 so let us consider this is equation 2. So now we have given a square plus b square equal 2. So let us consider this is equation 2. This is equation 3. Now multiplying multiplying equation 2 and 3 so multiplying equation 2 and 3 so a cube plus b cube times a square plus b square equal 5 by 2 times 
so 2 2 cancel so we will get a q plus b q times a square plus b square equal 5 so now multiply these two values so a cube times a cube times a square a power 5 so a cube times b square a cube times b square plus b cube times a square so b cube times b square plus b power 5 equal 5 so write these terms a power 5 plus b power 5 plus a cube a cube b square plus b cube a square equal 5 so in these two terms takes out common so that is uh, a square b square a power 5 plus b power 5 plus a square b square so we will get we will left a plus b equal to 5 so a power 5 plus b power 5 plus we can write this a b square a plus b equal to 5 so we know these values uh, a power 5 plus b power 5 plus a b value is what is the value of a b minus 1 by 2 whole square so now what is the value of a plus b 1 equal 5 so a power 5 plus b power 5 so minus 1 minus square plus that is plus okay place 1 by 4 equal 2 square 4 5 a power 5 plus b power 5 equal 5 minus 1 by 4 equal 4 times 5 20 so 20 minus 1 equal divided by 4 equal 20 minus 1 which is equal 19 divided by 4 so a to the power of 5 b to the power of 5 equal 19 minus divided by 19 divided by 4 so we got this value so let us consider this is equation 4 so now a cube plus b cube equal 5 by 2 so this is equation 2 so we know this so this is equation 2 I am writing here so from this equation from this equation 2 so we can do like this squares on both sides so I am applying squares on both sides so cube plus b cube square equal 5 by 2 square so a plus b whole square so use this formula we can write a power 6 plus b power 6 plus 2 a cube b cube equal so 5 square is 25 and 2 square is divided by 4 now a power 6 plus b power 6 plus 2 we can write this a b cube equal 25 divided by 4 so a power 6 plus b power 6 plus 2 so a b value we know this uh, a b value what is the a b value minus 1 by power cube so 25 divided by 4 so now a power 6 plus b power 6 
plus so 2 so this is minus value so 2 power q is 2 minus 2 so 2 power q is 8 so 8 times 4 2 times 4 equal 25 divided by 4 so a power 6 plus b power 6 minus 1 by 4 equal 25 by 4 a power 6 plus b power 6 so move this value to the right side it will be 2 5 25 divided by 4 plus 1 by 4 so now we will get a power 6 plus b power 6 so here in the denominator we have common number so that is 25 plus 1 which is equal to 26 divided by 4 so this is equation 5 this is equation 5 so multi now multiplying now multiplying equation 4 and 5 so we know this equation 4 so I'm writing here equation 4 a to the power of 5 b to the power of 5 equal 19 divided by 4 this is equation 4 so now multiplying equation 4 and 5 so a to the power of 5 plus b to the power of 5 times a to the power of 6 plus b to the power of 6 equal 19 divided by 4 times 26 divided by 4 so we can divide by uh, 2 so 2 times 13 and 2 times 2 4 so a to the power of 5 plus b to the power of 5 times a to the power of 6 plus b to the power of 6 equal to 19 divided by 4 times 13 divided by 2 so now multiply the uh, multiply these two terms so a to the power of 5 a to the power of 6 c a to the power of 11 so 5 plus 6 11 plus a to the power of 5 b to the power of 6 b to the power of 5 a to the power of 6 plus b to the power of 5 b to the power of 6 5 plus 6 a to the power of 11 b to the power of 11 equal so 19 times uh, 13 which is equal to 47 divided by 4 times 2 which is equal to 8 so now a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 plus a to the power of 5 b to the power of 6 plus b to the power of 5 a to the power of 6 equal to 47 divided by 8 so a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 plus in these two terms we can take out common that is a to the power of 5 b to the power of 5 so here we will write leftover numbers that is a plus b equal to 47 divided by 8 so now a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 plus we can write this a b whole to the power of 5 a plus b equal to 47 divided by 8 so a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 plus a b so we know this value just substitute the value of a b minus 1 by 2 whole to the power of 5 and a plus b what is the value of a plus b that is 1 equal to 47 divided by 8 so a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 so minus minus uh, so 5 minus we will get minus value 
so 1 divided by 2 to the power of 5 which is equal 32 equal to 47 divided by 8 so a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 move this value to the right side So move this value to the right side 247 divided by 8 plus 1 by 32 so a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 equal 247 32 times 247 plus 1 times 8 so 8 times 37 32 8 times 32 which is equal to 256 so a to the power of 11 b to the power of 11 plus b so 32 times 247 plus 1 times 8 which is equal to 7912 and divided by 256 so we can divide uh, by 8 so this fraction we can divide by 8 so 8 times 32 256 and 8 times 7989 7912 so a to the power of 11 plus b to the power of 11 equal 989 divided by 32 so this is the answer thank you for watching